Joe from Ojo here. Uh, winter time here in Canada. I don't like it. First thing that I did on the first two days that it snowed was start looking for flights uh, somewhere warmer. Um, anyway, when I travel, I bring my coffee with me. And most times I'm brewing coffee in an airport, on a train, in an airplane. And today I'm gonna show you how you can bring uh, travel companions when it comes to coffee with you. When I travel, I've got my toilet bag, full leather green, and, uh, and my porter bowl for bringing fresh ground coffee. In this kit, it has everything I need to brew coffee on the go, except for the hot water. So technically I could bring a thermos with hot water, but I figure if I'm on an airplane, if I'm in an airport, I can just ask somebody for some hot water and I can brew coffee, no problem. In my porter bowl, what I love about these bowls, we have them on our website as well, is they're a screw top. So you can throw it in a travel bag and it can be upside down and it is not going to um, spill out on you. So I usually just, for that purpose, I love grinding on demand, but when I'm traveling, I'm okay to grind a bunch of uh, coffee for a few days and just bring it with me pre-ground. And then in this bag, I've got my porter mug, porcelain. It is a mug that's designed for transporting. It's not gonna keep your coffee hot for six hours. It is made of porcelain so that when you put your coffee in, it's going to taste like coffee and it will cool just like any other mug does over time. Um, but what I love is it's got a silicone protector so that if it hits something, it's not going to crack. And um, the fact that it is porcelain doesn't change the taste of my coffee, whereas I don't like coffee in paper and I certainly don't like coffee in stainless steel. So porter mug, AeroPress, coffee piston device. We've had other videos on this. And um, in my bag, I've got the filters and my little measuring scoop. Although I did bring a measuring scoop in my, uh, in my bowl. I'm gonna show you how you can brew coffee with minimal equipment on the go. I love AeroPress because it's transportable, but by the time you're done, by the time we are done, you are going to see how easy it is to clean this thing up, even if I'm sitting on an airplane, how I can clean this up fairly easily. So I've asked the stewardess for hot water. She's made it for me. All I'm gonna do with AeroPress, I've got my own little pre-measured uh, scoop in there. I'm not gonna be picky on the amount of coffee I'm using, but it's roughly 15 to 18 grams. Put that in there. This can now go away. My funnel can now sit on the side. Grab a paper filter. Fill the chamber with hot water. One thing that I forgot to throw in my travel is you have this stir stick in there too. It comes with the AeroPress. A few little stirs because you will feel that there are dry grinds on the bottom. In my travel bag, I've got a zipper. In that zipper, I've got two bags. One for discarded coffee and one with a little cleanup towel. So, if I am on the go and I just stirred that, I will wipe that and then I can put that back into my bag. I will now take my filter and add one drop of water just to hold it in place. Turn that over, take the lid off the porter mug squeeze some of the air out of the AeroPress, flip, and just use the weight of my forearm to squeeze. Now I've done this over a paper cup before, and if I'm doing that, I will use my opposite hand to drive upwards so that I'm not putting a crushing force on the paper cup. That's why you should have your own uh, portable mug to press into. And this press is not a fast one. Just allowing a little bit of strength and a little bit of body weight until you hear that hiss. At that point, you have a really rich, sort of Americano tasting coffee. You can throw your lid on if you're on the airplane, and that way it won't spill. And in terms of discarding, what I really love with AeroPress, take off the lid, I can give everything a clean wipe. 
can throw that back into my kit. Here is the puck, and this is the best part about AeroPress for travel. So all you gotta do, pop that out. Now you've got your garbage going, a little bit of a wipe on your AeroPress, and it can be put all away again. Zip lock that up. I can take my garbage with me, and I can put my cleaning towel back in my other bag. And the problem I have is that people will start questioning what it is that I'm doing, and I will pretty much stink up the entire airplane. Cheers. Thank you.